Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Carson Cloud. So in this video, I'm going to walk you through how to run a backup and restore by using Windows File History to re recover deleted files. So Windows File History is a feature that comes with Windows 10. All Windows 10 have these features. These features allow you to restore a files that has been modified. Just say that um, you make changes to a file today, but you change your mind and you want to restore the contents like three days ago. So with files with Windows file history, you can do that. You can you can go back to um, to that day. So let's get started by turning it on. So what you need to do is. Let me um, go back to the beginning here. <clears throat> you want to click on this Windows icon and then Settings. Under Settings, there's Updates and Security. And then you want to click on Backup. I'm going to add a drive. So on my computer, I have a D, an E drive. You can, if you have a USB or a second drive, you can choose it to um, back up your data. Oops, let's see where it goes. Let's click on add a drive again. I'm going to choose the E drive as a backup. As soon as you click on that E drive, it's automatically automatically backup files. Let's click on more options. So under backup options, you can run a backup now. Look like your data has not yet backed up. I'm going to run a backup now. And backup file backup my file, so it's going to run every hour, or you can change it to daily, 15 minutes whatever you want keep my files back up forever you can keep it forever or you can do keep it for one year two years I'm gonna leave it forever or until space is needed so if you run out of space you want to do it until space is needed back up these folders so it's gonna back up all these folders for me under downloads under favorites, contacts, OneDrive, desktops, so all these folders. Exclude these folders. So if you want to exclude certain folders, you can add that here. Back up to a different drive. If you want to change your mind and you don't want to do, put it on the E drive or your USB drive anymore, you can stop using this this drive and and um, initiate. Uh, configure the backup again and choose the right drive that you want to back up once it back up you can do um, you can do a restore by click on restore restore file from current backup if you do that it takes you to all the files being back up today's date is May 26 these are all the files being back up today and you can see here previous version and the next versions to say if I if it ran the backup yesterday I can click on previous version it would go back to May 26 and if I have another backup which is May 27 I just click forward and it goes back back to May 27 so all you have to do is just look for the files you want to restore I don't have much here So this is a brand new computer. I don't have a lot of uh, stuff on here. There's the files. Preview. So that's it. That's the how you using uh, Windows file history to recover deleted files or files that have been changed recently. 
thank you for watching and if you like the video please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and have a great day